Hi guys! Good morning! Welcome to Maria Lesson Channel! So today's video guys, nandito po ako sa sasakyan to make sure po na hindi ako marinig ng asawa ko. Pinag-isipan ko po talaga ito last night. For the first time, nagagawin kong prank sa asawa ko. So bihira nyo lang talaga makikita sa vlog ang asawa ko dahil napakamahiyain niya po talaga. Pag may makita siyang camera, hindi na talaga siya makapagtok. So for the first time, ipaprank ko po yung asawa ko. Sana hindi ako hihiwalayan, charot po. So marami po akong nakikita ng mga video na artista na pinaprank nila yung mga kaibigan nila. Nangungutang sila ng pera, yung malaking amount. So ang gagawin ko po sa asawa ko. Dahil yung asawa ko, hindi ko po masasabi na kuripot yung asawa ko. Pero pagdating po talaga sa suporta sa family, support naman siya. Pero gusto niya po talaga pagdating sa supporting yung mga necessary lang, ayaw na ayaw niya, yung winawaldas yung pera. So, ang prank ko po ngayon sa asawa ko, hihingi po ako ng 70,000 pesos. Napakalaking amount po yon Ang gagawin ko po, dito ko po i-prank ang asawa ko sa sasakyan kasi nandyan si Sylvester sa inside. Ayoko naman makita na akala ni Sylvester nag-aaway kami. So, dito ko po isi-sit up yung camera. Tatawagin ko yung asawa ko. Papapuntahin ko po dito sa sasakyan. Sasabihin ko, may importante lang akong sasabihin na ayaw kung marinig ni Sylvester. So guys, parang kinakabahan talaga ako dahil hindi ko alam kung ano ang maging reaction ng asawa ko. Kung sasabihin ko, hihingi ako ng 70,000 pesos. Anong rason? Sasabihin ko yung rason ay para po ito sa piyesta. Kasi every year po talaga nagpipiyesta sa amin. Pero no need, hindi naman kailangan gumastos ng 70,000 pesos. So, hindi ko po alam kung anong maging reaksyon ng asawa ko. Kinakabahan po ako. Sana hindi po siya magalit. So, tatawagan ko po yung asawa ko. Hi, honey, babe. Hi. Is there something wrong? Is there something you want to talk about? Yes, uh, this morning I discussed that I have something to tell you very important. I want you to promise me you are not going to be upset or angry to me if I tell you this. That's okay, I will listen to you. Are you sure? Yeah. And I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how to say this. I'm actually nervous because I'm not sure. Or should I keep it to myself without you knowing what's going on? So I thought it's the best to tell you about it. Uh, yesterday, I talked to my dad and... I'm not sure if you know about fiesta. Have you heard about fiesta? Yeah. So, a fiesta, this is what we do in Philippines. We celebrate every year. We have so many visitors in and out in our house. And my dad said, this is going to be the cost at least 70,000 pesos so they can have a fiesta. So I said to my dad, okay, I have to discuss first this to my husband if it's okay. So this is what I'm trying to discuss about if it's okay to you that we are going to send to my family the 70,000 pesos so they can celebrate. Well, that's a lot of money. But it's just 70,000 pesos and it's only once a year. Who cares? Why can't they have a simple celebration? You know, it's so hard being a fruit picker and I can't even make that money for one day. I don't know how to say this to my family. They are going to upset to me. I mean, I feel sorry for them. They demand this to me so they can have a best celebration for a fiesta. Like, I don't know. They might be upset to me. I feel sorry for them. This is their happiness. It's our tradition, David. I don't know what to say. They, I'm sure they will understand with saving money for a house and Sylvester's future. I'm sure they will understand. I'm so stressed right now. I mean, I wasn't expecting your reaction. Like, 
I thought you might just agree like I am so stressed I don't know what to do <sighs> and you very pleased with that yeah remember I said they can still have a simple celebration I'm sure they'll be happy with that what I'm sure they will be happy with a simple celebration I will talk to your mum and dad you don't love me if you love me you would just say yes Honeybee, that's not true. I'm really trying my best so we can save, save money. You know, the cost of living is so hard at the moment. And I'm sure they will understand because it's the same in the Philippines. All the prices are going up. Remember, it's been so tough lately with the rent and everything and the food and petrol. Everything's so expensive. So are you saying spending 70,000 pesos is not worth it? why i mean it's a big celebration of course it's gonna be expensive you're gonna buy lots of pork beef alcohol what what my friends gonna do if there is a lots of visitor and it's it's not enough food what what can, what gonna happen i'm sure your dad knows how it all works because before he had to find ways to make it happen if there's no money so yeah, I'm sure he can work it all out. Well, I think it's more important if we can save our money because what if something happens in your family? If with your mum, she has a kidney disease and I think if they had a simple celebration, it's much better. You don't love me. That's not true. It doesn't mean I don't love you. Yes, it is. I'm not stopping you, but I hope you're making the right decision. Honey, I have something to tell you more than this is just a prank. This is just a prank! Uh, really? Yeah! <laughs> 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 it's a prank! Oh my god! <laughs> Honey Bay, why won't you let me to send them 70,000 pesos to celebrate the fiesta? Which means you're already bought. Oh, there's more important things than that. So it's better to have a simple celebration. <laughs> but it's just a prank, honey, okay? Yeah. It's just a prank. So, ayun guys, uh, nakita nyo po talaga yun po talaga ang totoong ugali ng asawa ko. Hindi po siya koripot. Dating po sa support ako sa family, hindi po siya nagagalit. Pero yun po, gustong gusto niya talaga na everything is necessary. Kasi alam na alam niya talaga, especially pag may mga emergency, kailangan mo talagang magpadala ng pera. Ayaw na ayaw niya yung minawaldas mo lang yung pera. Practical po talaga ang asawa ko, very practical. Pag ganun sa pira, ganun na ganun po talaga yun siya. Pero actually, he just trying to explain na kailangan ko talaga i-value yung pera. So, di ba? Nagustuhan ko actually yung mga reason niya. Instead saying no, hindi siya nagsasabi na they cannot celebrate, you know guys? Hindi siya nagsasabi na hindi sila makipag-celebrate. So instead, parang nililekturan ako ng asawa ko na they can, they can have a simple celebrate. Instead, bunga na bunga, eh, mawawala naman yun. One day or two days, mawala na. Wala na yung 70,000 pesos. Sabi niya, naptouch pa naman ako nung sinabi niya, yung nanay mo, nakakataba ng puso. Care na care po siya sa nanay ko.